Yeah, it's not <laughs> it's, Please, we must, we must leave the issue now of uh, massaging. Okay. Yeah? The storm touched off by the deputy president's West African tour in a luxury private jet is far from well, Honorable members, the official invoice sent to the office of the deputy president of the amount of 2,200. We are not aware of any other invoice of a higher amount. This should not be regarded as an official invoice. It, on the controversial tour, however, took a different turn. I want to go further, Mr. Speaker. I don't know if any one of us saw the cartoon that was in one of the leading newspapers today. Mr. Speaker, that cartoon was showing ladies busy massaging the deputy president, I'm sorry to say so. And the question I want clarification from the leader of majority, Mr. Speaker. Speaker, what I'd want to know, Mr. Speaker, is I have actually seen that uh, cartoon, and I'm not too sure whether there's anything there that seems to suggest that those are female members who are massaging. What? But Mr. Speaker, more fundamentally, because Honorable Cecily is actually raising a concern of equality in this house. So my concern is if indeed they put female members massaging Ruto, then I would want to demand from nation that they put a photo of me being massaged by male members of parliament for equality purposes. The members who travel can tell us better what happened. But Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, <laughs> Mr. Speaker, <laughs> Mr. Yeah, Speaker point of order. I would like to seek clarification. <laughs> Mr. Speaker, I would like to seek clarification from the leader of majority. Leader of majority is on a point of order. We did not come here to massage anybody's body, Mr. Speaker. We are here as members of parliament. I rise to just ask uh, three clarifications from the... Uh, Leader of majority. But please, please, we must, we must leave the issue now of uh, massaging. Okay. Yeah? And I must say. <laughs> you, surely, let's go now to the okay. most serious business. That, I must that, say. Judy